welcome back everyone in the last video i have discussed how to do the route setup and i also discussed that we need to create this splash view let's do that to create this splash view inside the leaf folder i will create a new folder named as features and inside this features i will create another folder named as splash inside this splash i will create a subfolder named as view and inside this view i will create a file named as splash view now this will be a stateful widget so here i am creating a stateful widget and let me give its name as splash view and here instead of returning the placeholder here i will return a scaffold inside the scaffold i will use body and inside the body i will use center and in the child here i will use image dot asset here i need to specify the image path let it be blank for time being in the width i will pass 80 and in height i will pass 80 now to provide the image here what i have done in the project here i have created a assets folder inside the assets folder i have created a images folder and inside that images folder i have kept an image named as logo.png and the entry of this assets folder i have done in pubspec.yml as you can see here in the assets i have made the entry of assets as images now inside this core folder here i will create a new folder named as utils and inside this utils folder here i will create a new file named as app image url now let me create a class app image url inside this class here i will declare a static const variable and let the name be logo and here I will specify the path that is assets slash images slash logo dot png this means whatever images I will use in my project that image URL I will keep inside this particular class now let me move to main dot dot sorry I will move in the splash view and here i need to specify app image url dot logo right and inside this routes folder let me move to routes dot and here i need to import the corresponding package that is this one now let me move to main dot dot once again here you can see in the title flutter demo has been specified here i need to give a different title now in the utils folder i will create one more file named as app string this file will contain all the messages for our application and here i have created this file this file contains all the messages as you can see this is the class which contains all the messages now let me move to main dot dot and instead of writing flutter demo here i will write app string dot app name let me import this app string and let me remove these unnecessary codes so i will remove this now let me run this once i run this then you can see that the splash screen has been generated with an image in the center this is how we can create the splash screen that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching